of stuff. A little too much stuff. Rainbow Bunny, Soul Eater. Yeah, well, there you go. That's what I'm going to make my show about. Rainbow Bunny, Soul Eater. It's going to be a hit. Watch. Yeah, I have intuition about these things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do -do -do. That's always an encouraging sound. Now, who says that sitting in a chair for long hours is bad for you? I drink so much water. It's got to be better for me, right? No, it's just good. It's just good. All right, chapter three today. Chapter three, Ultra Despair Girls. We finally found Makoto. So that should be fun. So now we are starting to see tidbits of everything that was going on. It's just kind of weird because I actually know everything that goes on, but I didn't know all the little details, so cute girls battlefield. Cat fights! And so far we've only killed boys. You're gonna kill a girl this time? Makoto! Kamaru, is that really you? Aw. Oh. I knew it. You're... You're Makoto, right? Anakuma, come here. Mr. Makoto Naegi, right? Mr. Makoto Naegi. Mr. Right, exactly. You're safe. I'm so relieved. I was worried the whole time. Same here. I wish I knew you were all right. I mean, I thought you had already died. Oh, Makoto. Hello, baby. I'm so glad you're alive. I'm glad too, Komaru. I thought I'd never see you again. Yay, Makoto. But I'm relieved to find out you're safe. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I saw Joshua's face. I saw the golden child. What about dad and mom? And Chihiro's I dad. Huh? I see. Then you don't know either. I was hoping that you would. Then they probably did. You don't know They're grown ups. It's gonna be all right. Don't worry. I'm sure they're just fine, wherever they are. But you have no proof of that. They could be. There's no proof they're not okay either. So let's just believe in hope for now. Yeah, if you say so. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so your brother's pro at this. It's, it's okay. Funny. I never thought I'd hear you say something like that. Really? Well, being positive is like my only good point. But more importantly, <laughs> like the only where thing are you at. right now? What's going on over there? I I'm at a building called Toa Tower. I was told I could use the communication device here. Oh, wait, that reminds me. Why are you answering? Uh, what do you mean by that? I mean, I called Future, Future Foundation. Foundation. Why are you the one who responded? You... you really don't know? Don't know? A about what? I'm with Future Foundation, Branch 14. That's my division. Toko, is this true? Yeah. Toko? Wait, what? Toko is there with you? <laughs> Toko? Ha, <laughs> ha, ah, shit. What? You got a problem with that? You disappeared. Everyone was so worried about you. <laughs> <laughs> worried? Like anyone would actually care if an intern went missing. You know I would never stay behind on a mission like this. Especially with Master going. So you tagged along without orders. Well, I figured that was pretty <laughs> much what happened. So we'll probably figure out why Toko disappeared. Wait, hold on. You two know each other? That's why Toko knew about me from the beginning? Yeah, she didn't tell you that? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I not? <laughs> no, I very much didn't. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like Toko. Anyway, I'm glad you two are together. I'm just with her because I have no choice. Your whiny little sister balls when she's alone. So basically, I'm just a babysitter. 
I guess this will prepare me for my future with Master. Hey, Ultimate hey, bullshit, I'm right? <laughs> so, where's Byakuya? Oh, we don't Master know. Is safe. Safe, but captured by the enemy. He's captured, but he's just safe. Just as I thought. Future Foundation's intel said as much. I just didn't believe it. I mean, Byakuya? Captured? He was pr probably taken by surprise by some fiendish cowards. Oh, did it There's for no a other way. Ugh, the son of the noble Togami family brought to the position of a mere hostage. Sounds like the situation is pretty serious. So serious, the world is gonna collapse. The ultimate affluent progeny is in danger. Ultimate? Oh, yeah. Byakuya Toko and I were all classmates at Hope's Peak Academy. Wait, you. You mm. didn't know that either? Yeah, Toko doesn't like to really tell no, stories. I didn't. Well, now's the time for your brother to explain it. Here's your chance. Now you can show off your utter lack of presence with your brother complex. Uh, I do not have a brother complex. Mm. I don't really know where to start. We weren't just regular classmates. But it wasn't like that. We were trapped inside Hope's oh, flashbacks. Of during the tragedy. We were forced to kill each other. Our classmates. Kill? Hi, everybody. A lot of our classmates ended up oh, killing the each other. Right in front of our eyes. Even after all this time, the memory, the despair, I can still feel <laughs> I it. I finally said it. That's planned. It, it wasn't just some movie? Or I was waiting for her to actually find out about it. I'm much more interested to find out about Nagito. It wasn't a movie. It was reality. It actually happened. And it was all broadcast live as part of the tragedy. The mastermind behind it all wanted to spread despair throughout the world. They wanted to show the whole world. The students of Hope's Peak Academy. The symbols of hope. Falling to despair and death. Well, no chiming in with a remark this time? But wait, you two are still alive, so... Yeah, we were able to defeat the mastermind who planned the killing game and survive. Of course, we couldn't save everybody. And after that, we left Hope's Peak Academy and went into the outside world. Yeah, we still haven't seen... Yeah, no, nobody associated with Kyoko. The outside, it was more horrifying than we expected. It was easy to get discouraged, but by supporting each other, the friends who survived hell together, we moved forward. Soon we came under future foundation protection. We oh, yeah, chose to lend ourselves to the cause, to fight against the remnants of despair, who are still trying to spread despair to the world. Yeah, so they can catch them and, you know, bring right, them up too. <laughs> Wait, why are we crying? Are you... Suffering Aww. and heartache. Togo does have feelings. I see. I didn't know about that at all. I never thought something like that was going on. But you guys are so amazing. I gave up immediately, but you guys, you guys fought. Confronted the problem. Yeah, you pretty much I guess sucked. that's why you've changed. No, not really. I was always being saved by everyone else. You saying that? Your brother got so hyped up from being declared the ultimate hope. He was always dragging everyone along. So eager about everything. <laughs> I wouldn't say I was hyped about it. Oh? But you don't deny the dragging everyone along part, huh? Jeez, take it easy on me. <laughs> Makoto, you've definitely changed. You too, Komaru? What do you mean? I haven't changed a bit. No, really. You really change. Might be weird for your little sister to say this, but you seem more mature now. Well, yeah, you know, people Just die. Just from this conversation. Kind of does that to you. I can tell you're more reliable than you used to be. Well, I don't really think so, though. But me? I haven't changed at all. Not since my imprisonment. Listen, about that. There's something I need to apologize for. Yeah, I could have got you out a, a year ago. Uh, the reason you were in prison there? It's because of us. If we weren't chosen by the mastermind, 
You wouldn't have ended up like this. Huh? What do you mean? You aren't you. the only prisoner in Toa. With you is everyone who is relevant to our classmates. In order to make us commit murder, the mastermind abducted people relevant to us and tried to use them as a motive. We managed to stop it before it got that far. God the thing was killing among loved ones. The mastermind was going to force us to watch you kill each other to make us really lose all hope. Huh. I didn't see like that little bit. I didn't quite know all that. The video of you, our family, being abducted was used for motive as well. Right. That was just the beginning. The mastermind was planning something far more cruel. Yeah, they hadn't stopped it before then. Huh. He's so boring. The despair, <laughs> and that motive was left unused. But even after that, I was still imprisoned. Probably the doings of the remnants of despair, trying to succeed the mastermind's will. Because of them, we were totally in the dark about where the captives were being held. But a few yeah. days ago, Future Foundation received an anonymous tip. We were told captives from the killing game were being held in a certain apartment in Toa City. So that's why Biakuya and the others were at my apartment. But because of those rioting little brats and their machines, the plan for saving the captives was scrapped. And even Master, the protagonist, was captured. <laughs> Makoto, you've already heard the ones causing the riots here are Monokumas. Right? So, did you figure out what the deal is with these Monokumas yet? No, we still haven't figured that out. Huh? I agree, though. Keep the Monokuma it's very monotone. Starting at the exact same time as the rescue operation. Strange. Like I said, it's no coincidence. It's conspiracy. Someone's setting up Future Foundation. Then that would mean the tip was a trap. Using the captives as bait to lure us there. Captives aren't just bait. They're targets for the massacre game the brats are playing. Massacre game? Yeah, it's even more fun. You can come join. The captives, part of their little game to taunt us. Wait, does that mean the captives are the ones wearing wristbands like mine? Then you. That's why they've all been related to everybody. That man with the computer. They're they're all captives. Yep. Yes, there are people close to us, people who were imprisoned in Toa, just like you. Kamaru, what you just said. Is it true? You're involved in this massacre game too? Y yeah. They put a wristband on me and now I'm being chased by these weird kids. Yeah. That's... And one of the brats who started this sick game said something interesting earlier. Something about big sis Junko. Yeah. Junko? Yes, Junko. You mean Junko and Oshima? <laughs> Junko and Oshima? She's the mastermind behind the school. No, she's the mastermind behind the tragedy itself. And she has huge boobs. <laughs> if, if, you know, we were missing any other point about the despair or the destruction or the killing, she also has really huge boobs. So as long as we know that, we're big good. Big boobs too? Yes, and she's got big boobs. Junko and Oshima is known as the true <laughs> ultimate despair. She was... Our former classmate. But didn't you say earlier that you already defeated the mastermind? Oh yeah, she did now. Yes, Junko and Oshima is dead. But it seems her memory is still alive and well. Even in death, Junko and Oshima continues to influence the remnants of despair. She's become a martyr to them. Now she's even more trouble than when she was alive. True. It's like they worship her. Like some big chested despair goddess or something. <laughs> we did Toko has this weird obsession with food. Well, lately, I've been thinking she must have foreseen this possibility from the very beginning. Listening to you guys is. I just can't believe it's all real. Yes, her big boobs are indeed. <laughs> The obsession is real. But I get why you think this is all just fiction. Crazy kids are killing adults, you know? Yeah. Things are just so messed up here. Makoto, hurry up and get over here. I 
guess it's a wristband. I can't get out of the city. If I leave without permission, it blows. But Future Foundation can remove the wristband, right? So please come save me. Kumaru. Hey, you are you your can't. own. I can't... can't what? You have to win. Why do you think they're holding Master hostage? They don't want Future Foundation to interfere. Like taking hostages during a bank robbery. Master Byakuya is being used as a deterrent. M meaning, if Future Foundation came to this city, Master would be... Then... Yeah, she do that Future the whole Foundation time. Future Foundation won't come save us? Then what am I supposed to do? Didn't I already tell you? There's no other way. You have to fight against those kids. Get rid of them, and you can save yourself and Master. That's impossible! No, it isn't. You have Master's gun, and I'm with you, too. Yeah, remember? But I... I can't take this anymore. I just can't do it anymore. Okay, well then we'll just go fall in the corner and die. Or hope speak. I'm just a normal girl who can't do anything. Kamaru. You, you can't. If they come here to rescue you, Master will be executed. Makoto, you better not come. If you even try it. I... I will... I will kill your sister. Kill? Wow. Toko, I'm dead. Makoto! Uh, and no more phone calls. Makoto! Goody. I knew there was some kind of trap in this somewhere. What? They're going to trap us. We gotta hurry and get out of here. But I haven't finished talking to my brother. We can't get through Little anymore. Little for that. And it doesn't matter anyway, no matter how much you talk. As long as Master is in their custody, Future Foundation cannot come to this town. But if it's Makoto... What? And Look out. you talk too much. Toko, calm down. Don't panic. I am calm. I've just been taking too many deep breaths. That's it. Just <laughs> lightheaded. Yeah, she's panicking. It's fine. We just gotta get out of here. Hurry or I'll stretch your cheeks out like rubber. What? <laughs> Got it. That's a, right, that's a strange threat. Oh, what? It's pitch dark. Are you freaking serious right now? Okay. Oh, this is gonna be bad. This is like Five Nights at Freddy's meets Monokuma's. following her footprints I knew we were gonna have to use that for something this paint the hacking gun can see it right I 
Oh, I gotta go, can I go around? Oh, I get through here. Hey, shiny things. Yeah, I hear them now too. I hear footsteps somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, I am trying to. Dead person, hi. Monokuma is in a gun. I just hear you, I don't see you. Here somewhere. Tired of this, I should go inside the washing machine and get some sleep. Sleepy socks. Right here? 
Do you believe water. anything that Truly they tell us? For an emergency like right now. Let's hurry and get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, hold up. Oh shit. Toko. Hey, Toko. Oh god. Fantasy time. Better listen well. If you wash black uh. clothes too many times, the color fades. But there's a way to combat this. What? How is this it's sexy a talk? Method. First, do the laundry like you normally would. Y yes, do the laundry like usual. But before you rinse it off, add just a little bit of beer to the water. Oh yes, I will. I'll add beer, anything. How just is like this? That. Faded clothes can be fully restored. <sighs> I'm starting to get better at doing laundry. Apparently, laundry is an intense fantasy. I can be the perfect lifestyle disaster. Don't go get a hold of yourself. <laughs> what? What happened? Uh, the door exploded. We found the emergency exit, but it's blocked. That brat. She betrayed us. A little more, and I would have blown up. I don't think she was our ally from the start. Exactly. That's why I didn't get why you were dressing her. Shut up. This is your fault. My fault. Why is it my fault? You're the one who said you wanted to contact Future Foundation, and now this happens. Thanks to you, I got caught in this damn trap. Take Ooh. some responsibility. Responsibility? Ugh, who cares? I don't want to hear your excuses. I just need some light, yeah? Light? More light? More light? Before she goes totally nuts? Then again, that might be kind of useful later. Do you just go splat? Or is it just blocking? There's a very long way down. Yeah, I thought there'd be something on the other side. Super precision shot, huh? God, the spare time dealer rate increases. Very nice. building than be in the dark.
Chachiro's not coming back, huh? Think he got beat by those two chicks? Well, not like I care. I hate him anyway. Chachiro <laughs> promptly got himself killed. Cut, ground down, crushed and stretched, squashed into paste, burned and eaten. Poor little Taro. I hate him. Even though I hated him. Anyways, Monica, why are we not holding a funeral this time? A funeral? Oh, that. I got bored of that. Doesn't really matter. We can't even fill the coffin anyway. But, well, if you got bored hmm. of it, guess we don't really have to. Yeah, that's no fun if there's not a body. But, um, do you think Jachiro really died? Hmm? I mean, if he did die, we should have found his body, right? I was just, you know, a teen. Piss her off. Sounds like you're saying Monica is wrong. Yep. Huh? Like I said, you're trying to say Monica is wrong. You're questioning Monica. No, no, not at all. There's no way Monica could be wrong. And speaking of wrong, aren't the people who put Worcester sauce on fried eggs just wrong? It's so obvious that fried eggs taste best when you drown it in maple syrup, right? Yeah, no. Look, I was just a little curious, that's all. My head's just a little out of place right now, is all. I'm just a teensy bit curious. Like about why mailboxes are always white, or how enemies become friends right after a fight. You what? don't have to worry about things like that. I, I'm sorry. It's not like I have bad feelings toward Monica or anything. So please, please don't hate me. Keep loving me forever and ever. <laughs> yep, yep. I already know that. It's not something to apologize over. I know you're just a sweet, gentle little girl. Huh? Gentle? Katoka, uh, you are right so cute, as always. The director, the producer, the sponsors, everybody was super happy. This is really creepy. And now, there's another business you have to attend to. And your mom's gonna come with, okay? It's going to be all right. Katoko is just so sweet. Everyone will be gentle with you. Oh, God. Very, very gentle. Oh, that's bad. No! I don't want gentle! Dude, this game gets way... This, this touches on some really dark subjects. <laughs> that was creepy. Oh. <laughs> 
Yeah, because she is not innocent anymore. And hey, more importantly, you mentioned there was work to be done. Did something happen? Yes, I've received a report from the Monokuma kids I sent scouting earlier. Those two schoolgirl demons are sending a communication from Toa Tower. Don't tell me they're trying to contact that demon society, Future Foundation. It's not a problem. I already scrambled their transmission. We also have a hostage. Future Foundation can't make a move regardless. And I have a plan. By taking advantage of those two demons, we can massacre all of the remaining free-roaming demons. You mean the Resistance? As long as they exist, our paradise cannot be completed. We should take this opportunity. Amazing! Amazing! I don't really get it, but it sounds super <laughs> amazing! Oh, Lord. I don't really know what it is, but I love it! Well done, Nagisa. W wait, Mata! Hey! I thought that was her rest of the skull. What's wrong? Or a skeleton. It's, it's nothing. Just... You're a little close to me is all. Aww. You're such a shy boy, Nagisa. Plan. If it works, our paradise can finally be built. And when that happens, the warriors of hope will level up to saviors. Hmm. As our new leader, I will continue to have high expectations of you, sir. Y yeah, you're right. High expectations for me. Did you hear that? Our children's paradise of smiles is going to be ready soon. Silence. Hey, you're listening, right? Kurokuma? Oh, huh? right. Kurokuma? You can talk now. Hey, are you anything like Shirokuma? <laughs> gangster I pimp on a Kuma? stays dark like this my life is getting shorter and shorter i can feel death behind me well well there's a good bit bodies then. behind you so what's that over there a power panel right so it would seem I 
appears to be the Pharaoh. Always like you here, said the nun. Yep, say there they are. yourself such an embarrassing title <laughs> the light in the darkness it's probably a riddle that has to do with light obviously but does the room next door have something to do with it well hell if i know with a big exclamation point on it. Hey, what are you making it dark for? You're doing it just to mess with me, aren't you? Oh, two, five, one, nine, zero, seven. Right? Two, five, one, nine, zero, seven. Two, five, one, nine, zero, seven. Do I have to make those six digit numbers four digits? What do I have to do? Yeah, shit, I don't know. <laughs> for you with your nice words. You just put you off with the nice words. I'm tired. Why do I have to do this? Okay, this is gonna help me solve the puzzle. So we can't add them. It's not enough numbers. So 
I didn't tell you why I'm afraid of the dark. It's not a happy story. Well, if it's something heavy, maybe I'll pass on the story for now. I, I see. So I guess we'll do that at some point. Okay, there is. First off, shiny thing. And then Dr. Row. I guess I didn't tell you why I'm afraid of the dark. It's not a happy story. Well, if it's something to make sure I get that each time. Maybe I'll pass on the story. Sorry for now. I, I see. Please. Oh, he looks like he's having fun. Let's get this really quick first. Seems dangerous. Alrighty. Give me one of those rooms. Yep. Challenge if you want to get past, you gotta win at hide and seek. The one hiding is a good singer. Songs are good, and when that song is sung, Beast Wanakuma goes crazy, but when the song ends, Beast Wanakuma overheats. Okay, so I gotta find this floating Wanakuma. Tutorials. Now this is really dangerous. All right, awesome. 
This is a really dangerous room with lots of beast monokumas lurking around. It appears the beast monokumas are controlled by the children's song. That's troubling, but don't be afraid. As long as you can find this singing child, you can disable all of the beast monokumas. Great. The Iron Maiden shape like a monokuma, aka monokuma maiden, is where the child is hiding. However, choose the wrong one and you'll get jumped by a beast monokuma. So look at the, for the correct maiden while you try to avoid the roaming beast monokumas. These monokumas move in a specific pattern, so it would be a good idea to figure that out. Also, when you're looking for the right one, you should trust the kid's singing voice. It's also a visual guide that will give you a good idea of where the singer is. So you don't have to fight against those beast monokumas if you find the singing kid. Yeah, this is gonna be ass, weird. But it's better than fighting against them. This will probably require a couple deaths. <laughs> They're all over the place. It's safer just to look for the hidden brat. Oh, this is gonna be so much fun. It's supposed to be some kind of indicator? Alright, so the three up here aren't really gonna move. Okay, that one's gonna start back and I'm gonna have to guess which one. Alright. Should be coming back around the, down this way, you know. Be careful so we don't get caught. Over here. Can I go? We got caught. Oh, no, wrong one. Come in here. I'm, I'm pretty much gonna die on this one. Can I not just guess another one? Yeah. stuck in there. He's actually, he's actually stuck in there. Oh god. Um, if I can't kill him and I can't die, how does, how do, what? Um,
Do you, can I? Maybe, can, can I leave? Can we just leave and start this all over? Cause you're, I don't think I can kill him. And if he, no, um. Glitch. I just have to like Yeah, I'm probably just gonna have to uh reload it. <laughs> Cause he's stuck. Sure, hopefully it's not too far back. Oh, okay, it starts right here. Dude, what? I, it was nothing I could do. We ran into a corner and he wouldn't come out, so I couldn't shoot him. So if he can't kill me and I can't kill him, we were just gonna sit there. I've been saving, I just didn't know when this was gonna take me back to. Well, that was fun. They're all over the place. It's safer just to look for the hidden brat. so we don't get caught. Oh, maybe it's the blue that I'm looking for. We got caught. No? Then which one is it? What are you doing, idiot Omaru? Problem solved. Fuck you, kid. I don't need to find you. <laughs> With this, we can get outside, right? Nothing to worry about now, right? Get that really quick. The ghost that Which wants to die. Me. Are you afraid of the dark because you're afraid of ghosts? Are you serious? There's no way I believe in ghosts and all that paranormal stuff. I may be liberal arts to the core, but I am capable of thinking logically. Then why are you afraid of the dark? You sure come going at me. <laughs> are you an idiot? Yeah, I gotta get my brain forced me to remember my trauma. The reason I'm afraid of the dark is because an experience I had locked up in a dark place. Oh, you did something bad, so you got locked inside the closet? That happened to me when I was a kid, so it's narrow and dark, and it's really scary, huh? Don't mess with me. This is me we're talking about. My story is way more traumatic than that. I was locked up in a place I didn't even know for three days and three nights. Uh, this is the worst. Not even a crumb of bread to eat. Ever since then, my mind connects dark and trauma subconsciously. I just can't thinking about it now is giving me goosebumps. Um, Why were you locked up? And who did that to you? Uh, 
they're remembering is just pretty sure it was a boy. Oh, I know you are. It's just he's give me just a second. Hold up one second. Yeah. Hey, I'm. I might be needing to go. I, I'm trying to see what's going on right now. I might not, but I might.
right. Well, I don't know. For now, I'm going to keep playing. <laughs> Yeah, pretty, pretty much, pretty much. If you're going to just go ahead and summon future like foundation, I will prevent it. You don't work to do anything. So you were serious. That's right, I am serious. I will do anything for the sake of my master. Oh, she probably master. would kill you for Biafia. <laughs> so you'd even kill your friend? Yeah. No, she threatened to kill Komaru if uh, the Future Foundation came because they're holding Biafia as a hostage, and if they come to try to save Kamaru, they'll kill Biafia. What? So she's like, I'll kill her if you guys come here, because if you come here, they're gonna kill Biafia. And she's like, were you serious? She's like, uh, yeah. Did you think I'd feel differently if you started Definitely. using the word friend? Don't even try it. I won't be fooled. But that's horrible. I didn't mean it that way at all. I really, I really do trust you. Hmm. Hey, you may trust her, but Togo doesn't trust anybody. And Ugh. then Hendrix himself came to my live concert three times! In my dreams, anyway. This guy, though. What? You didn't think I'd still be talking? Well, guess what? I'm still talking! Hey, by the way, when is that meat party with the pool of blood in hell gonna start? When is the meat party with the pool of blood in hell gonna start? This is gonna be a once in a century event. I'd go even if I had to pawn off my wife for a ticket. <laughs> Massacre! Bonsai! Jesus. M to the A to the motherfucking Sakura! <laughs> It has a great ring to it, a beat to it, the beatbox beating on my heart. <laughs> so yeah, anyway. Or you be Hey, how much longer are you gonna talk? Hey, you can't stop me. I'd kill you. My fans would kill you. Or maybe I just have to win you over. Should I go help a granny cross the street or something? Cheese interjecting into my witty banter. You high bastard. Horrific idiot! 
<laughs> Never mind, just be quiet. Oh, she can make it be quiet. I figured it would be a good idea to ask for advice every once in a while, but I guess not. Mm. He may be our advisor, but I really cannot stand all the noise. Maybe they just painted him all black. We already have great ideas for hurting the adults, so we can get rid of them if we want. We've already lost so many of our friends. Let's just keep him in silent mode, hmm? Oh, you're so nice, Monica! In that case, I have no objections! If Monica's fine with it, so am I. Now, let's hear about this plan of yours, Nagisa. How are we gonna annihilate the Resistance? Simple, really. We crush their secret base. No, I mean, I mean, not to mention that this was a game where people covered it. I'm like, um, if we send them back at all, and and we could at this point, we are literally already to the point where that is a possibility. So, but well, give me like 30 minutes. Did you find out where it is? Yes. If we ambush the place they believe to be safe, they will panic and be flushed out. Like ants who've lost their nest, they will wander aimlessly above ground. And in that weakened state, we crush every last one of them. The resistance dies with them. Ooh, Nagisa! How vulgar! If mm. you weren't on our side, I'd totally pee my pants in fear! What pants? Of course, we have every right to kill them. They've quite earned their fate. Yep, yep, right! As expected of our new leader, you sure have a good plan, Meow. Instead of right to kill them, isn't it more like duty? We promised Big Sis Junko that the Warriors of Hope will annihilate the demons. I still want to know exactly how whoa, they, whoa. like, Not did they only know AI so Junko? Did they know cool. Junko before so she cool. died? Like, There's I want to no know way exactly. I can lose now. I gotta work hard and hunt, hunt, hunt down those demons. Even though our team is missing a few members, we're really getting pumped up. Huh? Yeah, they keep calling her Big Sis Junko, but this is only- everything in the second movie hasn't happened yet. Well, yeah, I mean, assumingly, right. Right? I agree. Because they've already referred to when she was, uh, killed, you know? Oh, for sure! I agree so hard my nodding looks like headbanging! Coming up with that bitchin' mm -hmm. plan all without your advisor? You sure have grown. Whoops. I didn't mean like grown, like in the adult way. You guys wouldn't like that. It's like complimenting a ninja for standing out so much. Mm -hmm. That was a close one. Damn close. Hey, why are you talking? Monica didn't give you permission. That's what I was thinking, Aww. the same thing. Easy on me, Maggie, sir. Monica brought it up. Didn't you hear her say, you guys think so? Obviously, I am included in there. Right, Monica? Hmm? I didn't mean that at all. Dun, dun, dun. Hold oh. up. It's true that I may have chatted just a little too much. But talking but... is like my whole purpose in life. If you tell me to shut up again, I'll die. Die, I tell you. Probably, definitely, no, seriously, gonna die. Jeez, you're hopeless. Fine. Just keep it down, okay? <laughs> I ain't gonna say thank you. Ah, oh, gee. I sure hope there's no one in your group that can read mine. Don't want to say a lie that's gonna get sniffed right out. <laughs> oh, yeah. <sighs> seriously. Yeah, hey, y'all made him. I apologize for being late again, everyone. Did you bring more milkshakes? No. Hey, hey, hey! Where the hell have you been? You totally missed my hilarious dialogue! I was running an errand for a Miss Fighter. It sure was difficult finding sweet chestnuts. Are these chestnuts properly peeled? I'm sorry? No. Why? Mm. What are you, nuts? Are 
as expected of the great Miss Actress, your orders are quite detailed. Hey, even if you're our servant, you keep bringing up ancient history and I'll kill you. Sorry, sorry. I'll peel the nuts for you. Forgive me. Guess I have no choice. I'll forgive you. No! Well, he's not gonna die. Useless servants deserve to end up like this. Deserve to end up with green cheese and frosting on our face? <laughs> good, good. Go for it. Uh, this is troubling. I prefer salty things oh. to sweet ones. This is a little confusing punishment. Hey, where are you going? It has nothing to do with you. Nothing to do with me? You've got some nerve saying that while doing nothing on your own. Nothing? You think I've done nothing? Uh, Toko's getting kind of bitchy. It's true that you've saved me a lot, but I've been working hard too, you know? Saying that I haven't done anything? That's too far! <laughs> what do you want? You want me to praise you? You want me to say thank you? Too bad. I've never praised or thanked anyone my whole life. And that's why you don't have any friends! What? Leave me alone. I... I like being by myself. No, you're used to Rather being than by tagging yourself. along with someone like you, I'd be better off dying a solitary death. Someone like me? Meaning what? Someone who always has an excuse. A coward. Using that word normal as an excuse, always getting help from others. You're the type of person who always says, there's nothing I can do about it, right? You are nothing like your brother. Well, it's not like I really acknowledged him either. Hmm. Fine. Yeah, I think we're going to take some time going? apart. His naughty show sure likes salty things. You can go back to that dump if you want. It won't make any difference. Better than being here. You don't have to come with me. Unfortunately, I can't do that. I have my reasons. That doesn't make any sense at all. Yeah, master. So we can find the Aquia. Shiny things. Rubbing girl power. Healing effects plus one. Very nice. Alright, batteries are good. Some more breaks though. Can you give me some more, please? No, you gave me dance. I do not need more dances. of Monokuman. Monokuman? Will you be able to get through the Labyrinth of Monokuman? If you beat it, you win a very nice reward. Well, why not? Please? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, you're not going to 
be much help right now, are you? Okay, so we've got... The dancing things. I'm supposed to draw him over there. Oh, I've got the bomber one at least. Gotcha. Points. And mission accomplished. Huh. The game again. Oh, you assholes. around, see if I can knock the dancing on and then throw the car at him. Sneak a sneak around the corner. Are these all like. Huh, she has a sight. That's interesting. Is it still going? Jeez, enough already. Oh, I know. This is gonna be some ammo, though.
Domino effects. Alright. That's what I was kind of hoping for. Domino effect. Yeah, I hit one bomber, who ran into another bomber, who ran into another bomber, who ran into another bomber. What? I know. Do you love Domino's Pizza? Pizza, pizza. Even though we just did Domino's. But then we get more Domino's and then we get free Domino's. Hey, I think it's the first Nagisa I've found. Yeah, I think it's the first Nagisa I've found. Wait, I need that. Kid. Paralyze. Really now? That's exciting. It appears you've obtained Paralyze. It's a truth bullet that shorts out Monokuma's electrical system. Also, enemies hit by that ammo discharge electricity, damaging nearby enemies it will discharge. And to top it off, if the enemy happens to be standing in water, the electricity will damage all enemies touching the water. You understand science, right? Go on and give it a try. <laughs> Yeah, now Beast wants dominoes. You sure received a nice we had three point. dominoes because of the rewards. Are you still going to run away? Even with all your you weapons. Yeah, it was ordered to get you can get another fight. piece of stuff. Apparently we had one a long time ago and didn't realize it. I'm not doing this because I want to. See? You talked so long that it went away. You asshole! You freaking asshole. Hmm? Everything will turn out fine between me and Master will wait for me. <sighs> Act before it's too late. That son of a noble family isn't going to wait for you. So, you sure you don't want this? Don't mess with me. Said so I don't want it even if I were locked in jail, I wouldn't read that garbage. I see. So who's the publisher? What's that? I'm asking what kind of awful publisher would print this nonsense. <laughs> don't know, don't care, piss that they took my ammo. Whatever. Oh, hi, little E.T. I go that way? What's that? Over there? Huh, okay. Hey, stranger. Hey. Did you hear about this? Future Foundation is behind the whole thing. The kids, the Monokumas, everything. The incident has been calming down and Future Foundation is losing influence. They're probably trying to regain power by causing a problem and taking credit for the solution. Are you an idiot? Wow. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Of course they aren't. What do you know for sure? I've also heard the whole tragedy was their doing. Either way, those guys are not to be trusted. Don't mess with me. You've got to be kidding me. If Future Foundation shows up to rescue the adults, I better not see you asking for help. <laughs> It'll never happen. So right, they're making everyone believe that it's Future Foundation's fault. Human eye. Human eye. I'll try this paralyze out. Oh, I can hit him in the eye. <laughs> Is it too far away to get that one or can it see that? I can't see it from out there, but I can see it. It's so close, but so far. Bozo. Try that ammo from earlier. Hey JT! 
hurt Pokemon team. The only problem is that you keep losing with fail. I'm sorry. Excellent. I mean, as long as they're in water anyway, excellent. Oh, that's unfortunate. Hey, more mono machine. Maybe this time it won't steal my ammo. Well, who you got? Started that, so we'll start charge attack power. Venomoth, Snorlax, Mega Charizard, Mimikyu, Alolan Executor, and Swampert. That's a really crazy. Are they all shiny? See, I've used a Venomoth before too. Venomoth's kind of one of those underappreciated ones. I know. Sorry, sorry, Beast. <laughs> This was like you basically be talking about physics to me. <laughs>
that. All right, switch to dance. Oh, I guess I need to struggle there. Never mind. I reject you. Sir, sadly, it's fine. Knock back. Let's do. Woo. Your strong is amnesia, curse, rest, so it'll get its face bigger than crunch. Yeah. Crunch is a good dark move. Buying them, I'm gonna put them on here. Does seem like it liked that one. So sure, let's go with that. Hey, happy kids with your happy dead bodies. All right. Are you really planning on going back? Don't we have to? Yeah, you're gonna get back up. Die! She was so ugly. Terrifying. Of how bodies are just like shoved into the ground. There's just some legs and arms and oops, oh, anything. Tie the tongue with a rope and then tie it to a really fast car to kill them. Nail a hundred gazillion nails onto them in a cool pattern and then they die. Make them drink a lot of water and then lock them in a freezer. Make them eat their own- wow. Make them eat their own shit and kill them with fire. I'll never expect it. That's awesome. Lovely, lovely. If y'all any, needed any new ideas. I like Swampert. There's no point in being here. Now where'd you want me to go? This is where I came out. Am I supposed to go a different way? Oh, I guess you could have told me easy. Yeah, no, you say to go this way. So I guess I'm just gonna keep going this way. Yeah, she's a kid. No? Wishful thinking? Future Foundation was that they call themselves what future? I'm going to crush the hypocrites. <laughs> Do you see three mono machines? Oh, that's why I'm supposed to be going back to my Shirakuma. Go 
cross you over, huh? Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, everyone. No, come back. I found something interesting. It looked like a Monokuma had broken it, so it won't be of much use, but this seems to be a weapon designed by Future Foundation. It's some kind of bullhorn-shaped gun. Oops. Future Foundation always blabbered about peace, but their weapon was crushed by a Monokuma in a second, unless peace of chunk now. Oh, so they know I have the gun. Alright. Something over here. Oh, all the way over. Okay, I'm nuts. Why not? Monica. Um, where is Shirakuma? Dead. Um, hello? Hey, you too! Oh no, he's here. He, she, it. He's here. What should I do now? I... I don't know what to do anymore. To tell you the truth, Haiji and the others are in a conference discussing exactly that. Why don't you go on in and join them? They did not like us very much. But... but... That's not a good idea. 
Have you already forgotten you ignored his warning and went to tow a tower? Oh, that's nothing. That was just a small misunderstanding. We still have the same goal. To stop these out-of-control kids and free the mistreated adults. Isn't that right? I... I didn't really think it through that far. No, really. I know you can do it. Huh? Rather, you have to do it. You have to be able to save the adults. What are you saying? She's the complete opposite kind of girl you want for this. This is Armageddon, and we gotta band together and destroy that kid asteroid. Yeah, this is kid Armageddon. Come on, our future is in there. Jeez, what's wrong with him? Things. Exactly three months to the day has passed since the true ultimate despair died. Though it isn't completely certain, it can be assumed the world is returning to its former calmer state. To commemorate the peaceful future, let us celebrate some of Toa Group's charity work. They developed the air purifier effective against the toxic air in the atmosphere, which we've seen. Distributed their uh, inventions throughout the world. Manufactured and delivered weapons to combat the despair, supplied high-performance gas masks, built shelters on the war-torn areas, and detoxified portions of the land. Well, thanks. Toko! So yeah, you were also a student of Speak Academy, but your special right. talent. Didn't I tell you my talent is writing? They used to call me the ultimate writing prodigy. Amazing! That's cool! A novelist, that's really admirable! <laughs> it, it doesn't mean anything to be admired by a talentless girl like you. Jeez! <laughs> you think I'm talentless, but really I'm super good at something. <laughs> You're gonna say you're super good at reading manga or something, right? Oh. Damn. <laughs> Wait, you really were going to say that? N no, I'm special in tons of ways. Like how I use the desk mat instead of a fan when it's hot, or how I get called it, how I get called on in class when I don't know the answer. The only thing admirable about you is your stupidity. Aww. I kind of wish it was more normal in that area. Then, <laughs> now that I think about it, your reactions are pretty normal too. Stop it! And how fast do you run a hundred meter dash? Aww. I want to say eighteen seconds. And what's your favorite music? Top 40? Hmm. Horrifying. Mm -hmm. Gee, stop it already. You're making me sad. What's your favorite saying? And... All's well that ends well. And your favorite mm -hmm. food? Um. Ew, swallow's nest and tuna eyeballs? Mm -hmm. What? What? Mm -hmm. Something mm -hmm. wrong? No, I, I must have heard you wrong. What's your favorite food? Mm -hmm. Told you, swallow's nest, tuna eyeballs. Oh, and I like kangaroo meat. I'm going to pretend we never had this conversation. <laughs> How do you get kangaroo meat? I don't like that one dude punched in the face and knocked it out. <laughs> like that one guy you just punched in the face and knock it out. You make me what the fuck? Man, that, dude just that was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I have something to give to you. Yo, Coco and Fufu. Heard you went outside. Well, I figured you would. How should I put it? There's something different about you two compared to these people. What do you I thought mean? she was gonna say pizza, I know. How can I say it? The air around you, it's different. You two are always facing forward. But in here, the air is getting heavier and heavier. Everyone's stressed. Stuck in a dark and moldy place like this? How could you not be? Anyway, you went outside. Can you tell me about it? Did you get some kind of clue about people with wristbands? Not really. A little bit. Um... 
what's going on? Are you sure we always say normal this and normal that, but now you're freezing up? So... What do you mean? <laughs> Nothing, I was just saying something normal to use your favorite word. Oh, this is a good hey, talk. Hey, What's up with you two? I'm just trying to give you... I have another thing. Will you please just take it? Hey, hey. Do you have that food poisoning or something? I guess we're not talking to each other, so we'll let me give her anything. Alright, anyway. Just kids? Mm. We have to kill them before they kill us. But the kids have those Monokumas on their side. We have to do something about them first. What do you mean by that? It's like I said. We have to take them out somehow. I'm at my wit's end here. If I stay underground another minute, I'm gonna lose it. I'm telling you, without a plan, a fight right now is far too risky. Haiji, as leader, what do you think? I have everyone's lives in my hands. There's no way I'd put you all in danger. I'm completely against a suicide attack. Even for those who are prepared to die. So you want us to just stay here? <laughs> You're telling us to spend our lives in this shitty place, constantly afraid of those kids? My principle is to not waste lives. As a leader, I cannot accept a plan that defies that. B but I'm not telling you to stay here forever. I'm just saying now is not the right time. Does anyone else have any ideas? No. Hi, G. Is it all right if these girls join the conference after you guys take a break? H Hello. Yeah, we're back. You two. Nice are to see you. Two here. I already told you I don't want to talk to you anymore. Yeah, I know. Now, now. It's not the time to argue. You guys have to get along, especially at a time like this. Regardless, this conference is over. No, not yet. It's not like you considered all the options yet, right? Remember the idea I brought up before? Did you consider that? I already told you. It's impossible. I understand how you feel, but... Hey, what exactly are you guys talking about? It's about persuading the children. Persuade? Yeah, that's that your work. idea? It's obviously a little late for that, don't you think? But you guys are all humans. You can come to an agreement with words instead of violence. Yeah, we might. They can. You really think a group of monsters like those kids can be reasoned with? I bet they'd kill us the moment we showed up to treat with them. Plus this group here? There can't be peace with those kids. You know what they've done. But, but still, why don't you at least try? It's like Shirakuma said, we're all humans. Did you already forget who we're dealing with? Remember what that P.E. Punk showed us? Just because they gave birth to us and raised us, they thought they could control us all as hero. I hunted them down and let everyone go free. Yeah, why don't I kill everybody's parents? <gasps> Those brats don't even care about family. Things like persuasion? It will never work. That's right. They're not human, they're demons. And not just that, even if we tried to use family to persuade them, it's not possible. The survivors here don't have any children anyway. Huh? W wait, you mean everyone here doesn't have any kids? But there's so many adults here. Really? It's probably not a coincidence. Those kids are focusing on parents first. Yeah. Why? I guess that would make sense. Who knows? They have a deep-seated hatred of the ones who raised them. It's messed up. It's impossible to persuade a group like that. I'm completely against the idea. But if fighting is impossible and persuasion is impossible, what are you going to do? Didn't I already say it? The best plan is to just wait for a while for a good opportunity. And exactly how long is this for a while? I don't know. But now's the time to toughen up and endure it. You say wait and endure. You're just repeating the fact you're not going to do anything. Hmm. You're an outsider. How could you possibly understand? I am the leader of this resistance. I have to think about the lives of everyone here. Well, at least they're still recycling. 
What resistance? A useless leader like you? You're even more of a burden than this chick. What did you say? Hey, man, Togo's gonna punch like a man and get hit back. You don't think about others and just say whatever you want. You know, different than those kids. You're the one who's a child. Complaining, not even doing anything. If you don't like the way I lead, then you can leave. No one is going to stop you. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm leaving. But I know you're wrong. Let's go, Omaru. Uh, you're the one who's wrong, Toko. Huh? Yeah. What are you saying? You don't understand. You don't understand the feelings of the weak at all. I, I, I'm not blaming them for being weak. I'm blaming them for using it as an excuse. That's exactly my point. The reason they don't do anything is because they can't build confidence. I would know. You're someone strong, with talent, chosen for Hope's Peak Academy and Future Foundation. You don't know how people like me feel. You don't know what it's like. <laughs> I don't understand what it's like to be weak. You think I'm chosen? You must be kidding. Yeah, backstory time. What's so great about me, huh? I'm a walking inferiority complex. I don't have confidence. I never have. But what's going to change if I just keep saying that? Using that as an excuse every day? I... I learned that from the killing. I suffered for it, but I did something about it. So for you to say that I was just chosen, like I had nothing to do with it, I won't allow it. Please wait, guys. Oh, fighting is a big no-no. Anybody else think that she goes on to be Usami? Hey, emergency! Monokumas are attacking us! Oh shit! Huh? They're just little flat Monokumas. Oh, they found out about us. Oh, this is going to be fun. Oh, shit. Massacre.
I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Those, that's why. I'm out. Can I have those gifts? Thank you. No, it just won't stop. It's going to be okay, Kamaru. Just a little bit more. Do your best. Thank you for saving everyone. Did I save everyone? I was just kind of blindly shooting. Did it work? <laughs> All right, achievement unlocked. That'll work. I know, people about to die. Yeah, people dead anyway. I don't really know how many people I saved. This is your fault. Yeah, I figured it probably was. This whole time I've been so careful keeping this place a secret. I convinced people to stay underground. Stay hidden so they couldn't be followed. But after all that, this happens. The only explanation is that they followed you! You brought them here! We... we did? That's what I was thinking. When you contacted Future Foundation, the kids must have honed in on you. They tailed you. And you brought them right back here. Yeah, it's but now you saw shut it down. You did this to all of us. <laughs> That's not fair. I I didn't want this to happen. Oh, wait. These two protected us, didn't they? If they never came back after their stupid mission, this place wouldn't have been ambushed. Th that's a baseless accusation. You're just making an assumption. Well, as long as I'm assuming, I guess I'll go one further and say you guys are spies for the kids. Now, that's a little that's too far. That's not funny. What could we possibly gain from that? I remember an old folk tale about a war between birds and beasts. By using the face of both bird and beast, the bat played both sides. But because he couldn't get too close to either, in the end, the bat ends up alone. What are you trying to say? Bird or beast? I wonder which side you're on. They're not really adults, but we're not really kids. Huh? Uh, damn it, uh, this again! Please, make it stop! Why? Why now? What is that? Are they gonna execute someone? What, you're asking me? Don't act like you don't know. Lock us up. Well, shit. Damn it. They take away my stun gun, then they stuff me into this dusty room. It's all her fault. I hope she chokes on a fish she caught herself. <laughs> well, I guess I don't want her to actually die. Ugh. I gotta focus on Master Biakia now. Not that stupid idiot. I can't just stay trapped in a place like this. I gotta hurry and save me. I, I gotta save. Oh, uh, Lord. That's you. Th th that was close. Oh, oh. I was about to sneeze there. Ugh, I can't take this dust anymore. I gotta find Omaru and. Uh, seriously, why am I thinking about her at a time like this? So irritating. I like somebody. It sucks.
When you contacted Future Foundation, the kids must have honed in on you. They tailed you, and you brought them right back here. It's all your fault! You did this to all of us! It's all my fault. Everyone got hurt because of me. He's right. If I didn't insist on coming back here... And if I had just tried harder, if I were a better person, I could have protected them. I couldn't do it because I'm weak. Now you like to hear it. It's just like Toko said. I'm so weak. I kept saying, I can't do anything. Always relying on others. I never even thought about saving others. And now this happened. Sneakity sneak. Tra la la. Why, hello. Oh, there. God, why are My you name here? Is Kotoko Hatsugi. I'm the fighter in the Warriors of Hope, formerly known as Lil Ultimate Drama. Well, not like it matters at all. Open Sesame. Hi, uh, why? Woohoo! Sorry for the intrusion. Thank you very much. Phew. I reached way back for that reference. I had to deal with baby boomers all the time, so my gags are kind of dated. And speaking of old... Oh, I can't think of any follow-up. I must be nervous. <sighs> my heart is racing faster than 16 shots a second. Master Takahashi would be proud. Um... Yeah, yeah, I already know what you want to say. You were going to tell me a fighter should be a boy. And speaking of boys, I've heard some people say that slugs don't have a gender. But actually, <laughs> slugs have both male and female bodies at once. People who go around spreading half-assed lies about slugs deserve swift punishment. Okay, then. Fighter kick! Fighter punch! Chaka! Hacha! Alrighty. That's what I told them, that I didn't want to be fighter because I'm not good at P.E. I mean, I am really good at physical education, though. Oh, are you? How about you? You good at health and physical education? Is that... Is that even a subject you can be good at? Mm. There are no girls who dislike health and physical education. That's my theory, anyway. Stare... What? Truth is, I'm actually here to hunt you down. But I changed my mind. I'll let you escape. What? Yeah, it's why? not like my feelings about demons have changed any. I still hate them deeply. I still want to kill them all in the most painful, cruel way possible. Like, for example, drowning them in a septic tank or putting a razor under their fingernails. But that's not even enough. Ugh. I hate them with full Drowned power. in a septic tank, that would be pretty Anywho, nasty. Anywho, despite my hatred, the reason I let you escape was because you are super adorbs. Mm. Hmm? I love adorable things. I collect everything adorbs from faucets to toilet seats. You like Dorbies. So, I'm going to let There's adorable, adorable toilet seats. You go. Really? There is one catch. You're the only one allowed to leave. Four eyes over there is not cute at all. Mm. What? But shh. Keep it a secret, especially from the sage Nagisa. He's super strict with rules. Nagisa says I can't even drink soda during meals. It's not my fault the food is so tasteless. I mean, he could at least let me have a little. Tells me to drink milk, even if I'm eating cereal. It's like drinking curry soup with your curry. Uh... Anyway, let's go. Go on, get out before those chumps notice. But I can't be the only one to go. I can't just abandon all the people here. Oh, something wrong? Is your red flower blooming? What? Or maybe you just like locked rooms. Like, you're a murder mystery enthusiast? Mm. I can't just leave Toko behind. Well, I can understand a little hesitation. Why don't you just leave the cell for now? Come on, just step on out. Girls are more adorable if they're a teensy bit selfish. Not a good idea. And now... Yeah. Hey, <laughs> now we got shot with something. Did you turn your back on her? 
This is a denture launcher. So how about it? Pretty sweet machine, right? The smooth shaft, the fresh pink color, the brutal yet hypnotizing shine. Okay. about me yeah of course she would notice uh, 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 and she's back master Biakia must have been talking about me <laughs> i wonder what he's doing while he's calling my name jeez master such a purr oh wow i can't just stay put here i gotta get out of here how dare you think biakia would play with his willy He's like, I wonder what that's just doing while he's calling my name. <laughs> They're actually like, wait, what? <laughs> oh, that looks fun. I can probably figure out the little pink girl was basically uh, used to earn money. So, you can fight away oh, the tension. I thought it said break. <laughs> <laughs> Easy access piece, that's terrible. <laughs> I thought it said break. I thought it said rape! <laughs> it looked like break for the next thing. No, it said hotel. You can fight away the tentacles with the X button and the directional buttons. 
Tentacles will also attack from outside the screen. Use the right stick to switch the display. The tentacles. See, and oh the my tentacle god, monsters. and they're trying to get your boobs. And the tentacle monsters. See? Ah. It's gonna this be awesome. So Letting Koguru get groped increases the heart meter. You know what happens when that what uh, happens, like, right? It it if it fills if meter. it fills all the way, the game is over. So enjoy well, yourself. Because she gets off. I mean, come so on. So enjoy yourself, but you know, keep that in mind. <laughs> this is the best game ever. Final. Okay. Oh my god, this is so bad. I can't. Not the ear hole! How do I go down? How do I go down? Oh, there's down. Hey, hey! Back away! Back away! Not the moves. Oh my god, this is fucking. Oh. This is hilarious. Motivation, motivation, so much fun! Ah, go down! Go down! Please, no! Oh god, oh god! She's on the titty! Come on. She's on the boobs! Get off the boobs! Oh, that was straight crotch. That one is straight crotch. Rate two. That was a rate machine. Look at this thing. This is a rate machine invented by an elementary student because she got touched in her no no places. All right. My, my, you're persistent. But Welcome. we're just getting started. Welcome to Danganronpa. You're going to be slowly but surely motivated. Please, enough already. What? Normally, even it is that. This has been really, yeah. This is a, this is raunchy. It's hilarious. Ooh, you're so sexy. I've heard women are the best just before they're ripe, but this is beyond my expectations. Yeah, now she's got like some rape fantasy going on. But when they rot, they become demons. I have to figure out the perfect timing. Stop it. Why are you doing this? That's what I always ask. It's weird. I asked them many, many times. Ugh. The answer was always because I'm cute. I'm not a bad girl. This is just payback for what happened to me. If you think this is wrong, then what the adults did to me is wrong too, right? Yes, it is. If that's the way it is. There's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> I was like, do I have to keep doing this? <laughs> and just to throw it in there, they said, by the way, this is the opposite of child porn, so it's okay to put in a video game. Is it, a, is it wrong for a kid to be doing this? A little bit. It's wrong for adults to be doing this too, right? Two kids? Both are no good. If you're slapped on the right cheek, slap them on the left, as they say. No. no. Oh, she is very confused. Toka would have had anything against this. But meanwhile, Genocide Jill. Huh? Is this GPS broken or what? It's going like 35 miles an hour! Oh, why is it so fast? Is the Earth spinning away without me? Huh? Ah, 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 ah. I see, so that's it. The monorail. Totally they have a monorail at Disney World. It's the happiest place on earth. Where's Dekomaru? I guess I just so, keep running. It's a robot versus serial killer, huh? Oh, Miss Toko should write it in her next.
Ryan Toku! It's been so oh. <laughs> She's not just talking about wanting to ride the off of you. Oh, I didn't see you. Let me go on and hit you. That totally had Mondo hair. She gave him Mondo hair. He had corn hair. Oh no. I like that one. I like the ball of scissors. Roar! Give me a round of a wanna slice up some pretty boys. Beast Monokuma. Oh god. <laughs> I wonder if this is gonna count for the boss fight. T Togo? Oh my, my. No, not Togo. Something. No, it's not like that. Please save me. I will not let you. Huh? Adorable girl. Wow. And um, penny shot. And girls who aren't adorable deserve even harsher punishment. Hey, I ain't ugly. I'm just way below average. <laughs> That's a good motto to live by. So do I just get to attack her? Sticking out your tongue like that? Not adorbs at all. Well, no shit. I'm not the adorbs type. How do I get it off? How do I get it off? Why do you think so highly of yourself? You're the type of girl. How do I get it off? Taking her clothes off. Eee, so <laughs> no, Herbert, Herbert, I'll try it again. There we go. So we actually get to fight them directly this time instead of fighting a Monokuma. Hair. I'm actually 18, but this is really too much. If you're 18, then you're not a kid, especially not in Japan. Uh, oh my. <laughs> Shooting blanks, are we? <laughs> then 
Like, dude, the sexual innuendos in this game are insanity. Hey, don't make that face, or else you'll end up in a far more vulgar situation. Or is this Monokuma? Oh, monorail. Well there, you better stay put. If you don't, my hand might slip, and then I go a snip, snip, snip. Jeez, now don't go getting captured by some little runt. That was way too easy, though. Probably. You wouldn't come. Not that the other ones were particularly hard. I mean, right after we had that fight. Fight. What the hell are you talking about? I just want to save Master Biaku. <laughs> Toko, I was Ooh. so scared. Not Toko. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> girl on girl development. Whoa there, lady. I ain't got that kind of taste. Get off me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I tried to leave you. I tried to run away. Because anime, I know. I said such horrible things, like, that you don't have any friends. I'm sorry. I'm truly sorry, Toko. Oh, I have no right to accept that apology. Huh? Oh, even Dennis Idil has you morals eventually. stupid. Why the hell are you trusting a serial killer? What? What happened? Nothing. Just go for now. It would be a hassle to explain. Y yeah, okay. I don't really get it, but I definitely don't want to be down here anymore. Kamaru Naegi? More like Kamaru Naegi. <laughs> she just. Oh, come on, that wow. Wasn't even clever. She called her Kamaru. Kamaru Naegi. Lord. This room is really wonky. Why is everything all upside down and or like sideways? Oh yeah, the train's dark. That's right. <laughs> oh no! Here's the boss fight. Okay. A lot of paralyzed men to the water. Saying. This is acting, after all. Inside my heart, I can't help but feel unlucky. Speaking of unlucky, you really should have let me motivate you a little more. No, no. <laughs> Job. <laughs> it did look like hamburger helper. Hey man, we, I like their stroke off. No, no, no. This is the work of demons. All I wanted was to be the same as everyone else. A normal kid who didn't stand out. But she used me to get her dream. Even if it meant going to market with me. Well, the guys who wanted that are to blame too. Business with a mother and daughter set? How perverted can adults be? Oh, my mistake. I meant demons, not adults. Seriously, I'm so ashamed of myself. Wow, it was a mother daughter thing, to even. What those ugly demons <laughs> used to say. Yeah, apparently she got like her mom. Apparently, her mom like used to do porn, so she and she sized their daughter up, and the dad did it so that he wouldn't have to work and can cheat on the side. Like, wow. But everything <laughs> has changed now. 
every man's fan is mother daughter. Exactly. <laughs> mother and like seven year old daughter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> are like that there are good people who then why didn't anyone save me if the world is so good why didn't anyone help me escape well doesn't matter what i said just now that wasn't how i really feel that was acting just leave it to the former child acting genius and a perfect performance is easy as cake lasagna hamburger helper i like the beef stroganoff <laughs> and also i've been saved by big sis junko anyway Oof. That name again? I'm sick of hearing that name. Oh? Does Miss Ugly Glasses over there happen to know Big Sis Junko? Oh, we know Junko. <gasps> Miss Ugly Glasses? You guys have no idea. You don't know how horrifying that woman really is. You were fooled. I don't know how she convinced you that she was some sweet, gentle girl, but... No, oh, she said gentle. 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 Yeah, when they're gentle, I get all flinchy. Anything but gentle. Please, no, stop with the gentle. What happened to her? This doesn't look like acting. No, that is not acting. I'm gonna buy a stork so Monica and I can have a kid. Okay, so I can get up. Oh god, what? the hell. Yeah. Okay, so... on the edge. Okay, so it's in the middle. Okay. I got 
pretty much gotta stay on this paralyzed. My bad. Shit. Okay. I was so With close, too.
Oh, did I win? Okay, cool. Hell yeah. And another death. Nice transformer, Kuma. exist we cannot rest we cannot live in peace at this point the damage is irreversible i i figured yeah. that something like that was behind all of this and i do feel you no matter how pitiful you are it doesn't mean that you can hurt others to just treat them how they treated you that's just going to make everyone equally miserable. <laughs> so you're saying we should just take it? You're saying we should abandon all hope? <laughs> hope? No, it's fine. Let's end this already. I want you to leave this town. Huh? What? He you wants want us to, to leave? leave? Right. You want to escape the city, right? Then I will let you leave. Satisfied? Well, yeah, but I don't Nagisa, believe you. Are you sure? It's my decision. At but what about Monica? I'll persuade her. <laughs> Hold on. Are you seriously saying you're just gonna let her go? Until you two arrived, our revolution was progressing smoothly. Hmm. I don't want you. Yeah, to you're fucking it up. Anymore. Get out of here. So please, just get out of here. Stay away from us, please! Huh. Well, I'll be interested to see if that actually works. Um, what the hell? All right, all done. Was it the demonic circle? Yay! Monica's very own special made magic circle. Sure, we'll call it that. <laughs> oh, you're awfully chipper! Well, of course. Everything is going swimmingly. When you spin, spin, the world is spinning, and Monica's at the center. Everything is all thanks to my wonderful allies, playing their part and doing their best. Looks like time's winding down. 
Just a little bit longer and we'll have a brand new successor on our hands. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Generation Junko and Ashima, huh? Well, things are getting pretty interesting around Second here. generation Junko and Ashima. <laughs> So I wonder if they're the ones who end up making Jinko the way she is in the second one. More fantasies! Best part. I the kids. There's gum on the bottom of my shoe. Get it off with your mouth. I suppose I can forgive you after that. Of course, I don't want your spit on my shoe either. <laughs> and our bonus. All right. End of chapter three. To be continued. Possibly tomorrow. I have to see what all's going on. I don't know what's going on anymore. I don't know what we're doing anymore, but chapter four is where we will start next time. Yay! I always just wait to get to the end and we get to battle Monokuma and have a Byakuya fantasy. Why not? Who doesn't want that? Pumba! It's dark in here. I need to say something. I had that light on. And let there be light! Hey, what is that? Is that that movie? No. Take it off the computer. Yeah, that really wasn't too bad, actually. Move and dry a lot helps when I don't have to uh, do things over and over and over and over and over again. And we can just kind of move through the story. Impressed! I know! It's excellent. Um, If I... What's tomorrow? Friday? believe I could tomorrow. Unless other things go down, we shall see. No, so, you know. It's been good. It's only been like three hours. So I will go with that. Alright, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go make some tacos. Get some food. Pumba apparently needs attention. If you can't tell, he's been staring at me for the past five minutes. Little boy. <laughs> well, thank you for hanging out. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. So that's be an afternoon thing. Gotcha. Alrighty. I will let you know for sure then. Thank you for hanging out. And I will see you for chapter four very soon. Bye.